Like many other palpation tests, the Gillet test has a low reliability with a kappa value of 0.22. The same authors also report a sensitivity of 43% and a specificity of 68%. So altogether, the use of this test in clinical practice is at least questionable. To perform the test, position yourself behind the patient and palpate both posterior superior iliac spines, which should be at the same level as the spinous process of S2. Now to test the right SI joint, palpate S2 with your left hand and the right hand stays on the PSIS. Now ask your patient to flex his hip to 90 degrees. In a normal SI joint, the PSIS will drop below S2. In a dysfunctional SI joint, which is blocked or hypermobile, you will see that the PSIS will not drop or move only minimally.